radiation for medical diagnostic tests has gotten a lot of a lot of uh, press in in the recent years from in the public press but as pediatric radiologists we've been aware of the concerns about uh, radiation for many years and we've paid careful attention to the amount of radiation that is used when imaging children um, during our diagnostic tests well we all get exposed to radiation from the sun and the natural, um, the natural sources in, in, in the environment around us. When you add medical radiation, that adds to that, that baseline level. And we are working under the assumption that any additional radiation is potentially harmful. Many institutions do not pay attention to that. If you walk into an adult institution, they may put a child on a scanner, on an x-ray table, and use exactly the same dose from that x-ray from that x-ray machine as they would for an adult, overexposing the child. So there is no imaging equipment specifically created for children or, or small size for children. The radiologists are acutely aware of our concern and our desires to lower radiation doses. So we scan the area, the, mo the minimum amount of area scanned as possible. We use single phase scanning, meaning we don't scan over and over again. Um, and we do it at the lowest power possible to get the diagnostic quality image, but not anything more. One thing that's very unique about Larry Children's is that we have three full-time physicists that work in-house, so every imaging procedure that we do has a medical physicist present. It's different than other hospitals where they use contractors or consultants. Here we have people that are all the time optimizing the dose and maximizing our image quality. So before we ever even have a patient here at Lurie Children's, what we do is we optimize our protocols so that they are tailored to the patient's size so that we never use more radiation than we need. So children are actually more radiosensitive than adults because they're growing and their cells are dividing faster. So we have to be very careful and very conservative when we use radiation for imaging. So here at Lurie Children's, we make every effort possible to use the newest technology, the state of the art, and we minimize the radiation use in all of our procedures. Who, you're going to tell them who you brought with you today, too. Yeah, who? So you come on my side. We're going to hop up on this camera. It's like our old camera, right? Hop right up on here with your giraffe. Oh, good girl. Ready for a boost? Ready? Up we go. Okay. Lay down. So good. So I'm going to put some seat belts on. You ready? Just like we practice? Okay. Arms are going to go up. Ta-da. Should we take a picture giraffe too? Seat belts on. Seat belts on. Are you snuggled? Good. Okay, now we're gonna go up. Up, up, up. Whoa, good thing we got our seatbelts on. We're going fast. All the way up. Is it time to go into the tent? Okay, should we keep going forward? Yeah. Oh, whoa, good job. We're going into the tent. Ta da. Can you see our lights? Should we go right here? Let's. And we didn't see Frosty, huh? Is he at home chilly? Chilly, right? Nah. Okay, you straighten your legs and we'll slide back. Oh, thanks. Still as a statue. Ta da! Up here, one there, and that one. What's he doing with his cheeks? Is he going like this? Just like that. Can you do it like him again? That's what he does. He tells you to take a breath and go. <gasps> Lay down, put your head right there. Good job. Let me come around. Oh, arms up. You're so good. I'm just going to shimmy your tush a little. We're going to get you straight. Ready? Oh, there we go. Can we put seatbelts on? Oh, she's practicing her breath. You're so good. Can we put seatbelts on? Should we take blue, too, and brownie? Let's keep them safe, too, huh? Oh, ta-da. OK, we're going to go up. Can you practice those breaths again? Good job. How long can you hold it? Do you think that's the American Girl doll store? I think it is. <gasps> right, that one, that one, the big one. Definitely American. Oh, I see your toes. You see your toes? Let's keep going. What's he telling us to do? <gasps> Good job. Now we're taking Anna's picture right here. 
Let's do that breath one more time. Practice again. Good job. That was a good breath hold. Nice job. That was perfect. You did great. Oh, woo, you held it even longer than I thought. Hey, you had sprinkles all over? <laughs> She's practicing her breath hold. She's very good at those now. Hold it. You beat me. I couldn't hold it that long. Yep, okay, Anna, are you ready for your pictures? All right, come on in, hop up here. Head's gonna go right here. Oh, good. Excellent, can we shimmy those buns, lay nice and flat? Oh, thank you, good job. Arms up, arms up. Let's put our seat belt on. The moon is coming, oh, you found it. Is that your favorite, is the moon? Yes, ta-da. Okay, ready to take our pictures? Oh, is it gonna come back? I hope so. Soon, right? What else do you see? Stars. You see stars. What else? Buildings? What kind of buildings? The moon's coming. Good. Is it coming back? Ooh, that was like just a bright star, right? Not really ready for the moon yet. Soon, though, huh? You want to practice those breaths for me again? Remember what he's going to show you how to do? Good job. Just like that. 